So, Florida State fans, what have we gotten ourselves into this year? Oh, man. I don't know about you, but I'm ready for uh, next year. Maybe. If it looks like this, just, just, let's just stay in the offseason. I don't know. Um, I did come to bring a little bit of hope for us today, you know? Now, I understand the comparison I'm about to make. It might not be apples to apples. It could be peaches to bananas. But there's a, a silver lining in it. There's a silver lining. So, South Alabama played Northwestern State back in, I think, week three or four, whichever one, because, you know, they got that zero crap, so you got the, I guess it would be four. I don't know. Anyway, they played early in the season. And um, South Alabama destroyed this team, 87 to 10. Now, I'm not saying we're going to go drop 87 on Charleston Southern. We haven't gotten past 20 points, I think, since the first game. But they were both equally sorry. They both were 0-2 at the time, and we're both 1-9. and So if it's not now where we can put something together that looks like a company team, then maybe we should just fire every damn body. Because, man, 1-9 is, 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 is not where we should be. It's fine for people like Charleston Southern. They might live in this neighborhood. I feel like I'm out of place. So, this week, Mr. Novell, this week, when we face somebody as equally sorry as we are, and they should be sorry because they like two levels down, we should just be faster, bigger, stronger, smarter, all of that. I want to see a blowout victory. And I think this year, a blowout victory could consist of at least just getting 21 points on the board. Maybe this wasn't as, as inspiring as I thought it was. I'm sorry. But I mean, you know, at least they're, they're, they're one and nine. So this week, Mr. Novell, this week,